U.S. health officials have confirmed the nation's first case of polio in nearly a decade in a suburb outside New York City. The New York State Health Department said Thursday a Rockland County resident was diagnosed with the disease after experiencing paralysis a month ago, but is no longer contagious. Testing by state health experts suggested the case stemmed from a strain of weakened virus used in oral polio vaccines overseas. The vaccines can sometimes cause a polio infection and have since been discontinued and replaced in the U.S. by inactivated vaccines, which only use dead germs from the disease. But local health officials say the infected resident wasn't vaccinated and exactly where or how he was exposed to the disease remains under investigation. While polio has no cure, infection rates have been reduced dramatically worldwide thanks to vaccination. At its peak, it was once one of the most feared diseases in the United States, with waves of infections disabling about 35,000 Americans every year in the late 1940s. The U.S. CDC says the last known U.S. polio infection of any kind was traced to an oral vaccine in 2013, while no cases have originated inside the U.S. since 1979.